Hello everyone, welcome to Camp Diamond Creations and another tutorial. Today we're going to learn how to crochet two stitches together to make one. So as always, I don't like to dawdle, so let's get started. How is everyone doing on today? Welcome back to my channel and welcome to my new subscribers. Today we're going to learn how to crochet two stitches together to make one. So I have a swatch here already. I have uh, made a few rows. I have some single crochets, some half double crochets, double crochets, and triple crochets. So let's go. We're going to begin with our single crochet and I'm going to put the, always have the abbreviation up at the top. Go ahead and yarn over and pull up your loop. You have two loops on your hook now. Immediately go into the next stitch with your hook. Yarn over and pull up a loop. Remember beginners to twist your hook. Now you have three loops on your hook yarn over and pull through all three and that is how you single crochet two together let's do that again go into your stitch yarn over and pull up a loop yarn over I'm sorry <laughs> immediately go into the next stitch yarn over and pull up a loop and yarn over and pull through all three so now we're going to work the half double crochet two together you see what that looks like now we've made those four double cro uh, single crochets into two single crochets so now for the half double crochet yarn over go into your stitch yarn over and pull up a loop yarn over and pull through only two of your loops go into the next stitch immediately without yarning over now yarn over and pull up a loop yarn over and pull through all three just like you're making a half double crochet let's do that again yarn over and go into your stitch yarn over and pull up a loop yarn over and pull through two yarn over again and go into the next stitch i'm sorry don't yarn over go into the next stitch yarn over and pull up a loop and then yarn over and pull through all three now let's move on to our double crochet go into your stitch yarn over and pull up a loop yarn over and pull through two yarn over again I'm doing that wrong after you pull through two yarn over again and then go into the next stitch yarn over and pull through two yarn over and pull through all three let's do that again yarn over go into the stitch yarn over and pull up a loop yarn over and pull through only two yarn over go back go into the next stitch yarn over and pull up a loop yarn over pull through two yarn over and pull through all three now let's work on our triple crochet so now with your triple crochet naturally you're going to yarn over twice go into that stitch yarn over and pull through two yarn over and pull through two now two loops on your hook loop around twice again go into the next stitch pull up a loop yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through all three of those loops yarn over twice again we're going to make another one go into the next stitch yarn over pull up a loop yarn over pull through two yarn over pull through two yarn over twice again go into the next stitch yarn over and pull up a loop 
Yarn over, pull through two. Yarn over, pull through two. And yarn over and pull through all three. So that is how you make your stitches. That is how you crochet two together to make one. So I'm just going to finish this off here with a single crochet. I'm sorry, with a chain so I can show you what it looks like. But this is what it looks like at the bottom. And this is what it looks like on the other side when you do your decreases. Let me go ahead and put a knot in here. Put a chain in here, rather, so you can see what that looks like once you get it together, if I can get it together. Let's chain one here and see what it looks like. So you see how your stitches are now. You have less stitches on this side than you have on the other side. The other side has more stitches. The other side has 16 stitches, I think. And so we've decreased that into however many stitches. Don't ask me. I can't count. It's too early in the morning. But that is what you get with that when you do that. So I want to thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. And follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok at Cam Tai Handmade Crochet. Bye-bye.